Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So after posting a couple of days ago that Office LTSC long-term support channel 2024 is now available, it seems now that with the launch and the start of the rollout of Windows 11 24H2, which is this year's annual feature update as I posted yesterday, Microsoft now has launched Office 2024 for consumers. Now both those videos will be linked down below and in the end screen. And Office 2024 is a non-subscription bundle of apps which is now available for purchase. So if you just head over to those sites where you can purchase Office 2024, so if you want the home and student version, that'll be $149.99. And obviously you can just do a conversion into your own currency. And if you're looking for the more expensive package, that will be office, home and business. And that's $249.99. Now Office 2024 is a one-time purchase if you are not ready to move to a subscription. Although... It does include many features and updates that are currently available for Microsoft 365 subscribers. And as mentioned, it's a one-time purchase and the versions of the classic Office apps replace the previous 2021 editions. So those have also been updated. And Microsoft Office 2024 includes the desktop apps for Word, Excel, PowerPoint and OneNote. And obviously, you'll get a license to install them on one PC or one Mac. So obviously, that's a bit of a difference between 365. And some things just to take note of is there's no support for Copilot AR features. And the Outlook email app is not included in the Home 2024 edition. You can see it says for the Home, it says Word, Excel, PowerPoint, and OneNote. And if we head to Office Home and Business, it's only included in Office Home and Business, Word, Excel, PowerPoint, Outlook, and OneNote. So just take note of that. Now, some other things just to bring to your attention is that there's also no publisher. Because as I posted earlier this year, a publisher was discontinued earlier um, this year in 2024. And it will be available for Windows 10 and Windows 11, and the three latest versions of Mac OS. So just some information just to keep you guys posted. And as mentioned, both these pages will be down below. And if you want more info about what's new in both Office 2024 and Office LTSC 2024, then I'll also link this website down below because it'll give you all the information you'll need regarding some new features and add-ons and updates if you would be interested. So thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.